so I already did a little bit of work on um, the arcs 460, 560 and 570. I was able to get like around for one or two watts, I was around one mega hash or a little bit less than one watt for one mega hash. So um, you can see um, I fiddled a little bit with it. So <laughs> I had some some breakdowns in the process and now I'm on my new settings. Um, I got this card where before around 10.6, this one also was around 10.6 and they both behave a little bit different by drawing the internal wattage they draw they behave a little bit different you see this card i can get a little bit higher because it doesn't change the wattage it draw and this card um, is a little bit lower because it just draws significantly less wattage if i keep it in this position and it's and it's, um, to get even the same mega hash, I need to put in six, six additional watts here. This card, I was managing to get additional 1.3 mega hash with one watt. And this card, I was able to lift from 25.8 to 26.56, so around 0.7 three four it depends it always varies a bit so i was able to pull it up with one watt around one a little bit less than one mega hash um i maybe i will fiddle further with this and I, then i will give you an update on the new situation but at the moment i'm pretty fine how it is now uh, according to um several mining websites the rx 460 560 should be around 12 mega hash with 41 watts so i'm fine with my settings and the rx 570 can get up to 32 mega hash with a bias update which i didn't install maybe i will install the bias update maybe i will get additional mega hash out of it after it but I'm pretty sure I want to keep it under 70 watts. And also, since we have winter here, I have to consider like how to cool it better in the summer. And if I keep the watts low, this is not one of my biggest concerns. Like at the moment it's an enclosed area. And when I put it in a not so enclosed area, maybe with a window, the wattage will, uh, the heat dissipation will be way better, and it is at the moment. So, I keep you updated 